Okay, got the American Standard compressor. The the model number is a GP four eight three dash JJ one dash GA. The serial number is a G three one one Y B H N. So if you know when it was made, let me know. We're gonna cut it open. Okay. Here it is with the top cut off. So the motor's at the top. And the sun's kind of crazy here, so. This is the discharge. And then, uh, there's a relief valve here. And then these two pieces here. help the motor so when you when you're tipping it it's gonna bang against the shell because the uh, the motors on uh, springs down here and see if I can get them up but a lot of uh, a lot of pieces so these must be your in intakes Get it there. And you have your plug for the motor. There's the plug. So I'm going to see if I can get that uh, motor out of here. You can see how it sits in a bunch of oil down at the bottom. Appears to be Vaveline. Just kidding. Just kidding. Okay. This is the uh, bottom of the compressor with the uh, compressor, obviously, and the motor pulled out. Then you have the tube in the bottom that's coiled. That's actually a steel tube. Steel tubing stuck in the oil. That's the discharge tubing. So it heats the oil, boils off uh, some of the refrigerant, help with migration. And there's the uh, motor laying on the side here. Here's the bottom oil pickup. A lot of uh, a lot of pieces to this motor. Tons and tons of pieces. This is some of the pieces that came off the compressor. So these two are your discharge. That went over on this side. So when the motor's turning, you can see the pistons going in and out. That's the motor itself. A lot of weight there. That's the motor. A lot of pieces to this compressor. I'm actually a scroll over myself. And this here's a discharge tubing. This is actually steel. Looks like copper, but it's steel. A lot of pieces. Just like a motor, here's your your block.
There's where the pistons went. Here's your piston. You see the piston ring and the wrist pin. There's the other one disassembled. Tons of hardware.